if this 138 year periodicity of a phenomenon that affects our world is true, then I should be able to count 138 years into the future to find m- more of this evidence. So I get to 1488, I get some atmospheric deals, get some, well, but I do get the birth of Mother Shipton. Mother Shipton prophesied about the Phoenix phenomenon. She even dated it 100 years after a world war. She said the sky dragon will appear. And she perfectly describes Phoenix phenomenon. That's really crazy. Then I find the writings of Nostradamus, where he specifically pinpoints the month of May for the year 2040. He writes about the Phoenix. I'm not on board with channeled materials. I'm not on board with anything I can't verify. All the channeled materials, can't. No, I'm not, I'm not on board with them at all. Nostradamus mentioned the year 1903 concerning the Phoenix. He also mentioned the Phoenix. He says many will die before the Phoenix dies. Archaics isn't about doomsaying. It's not. So uh, all this is in my published books. I have so much data on the Phoenix, but this is this is the this is how my research went. After studying the whole history of the world, I found this, I found this 138 and it didn't make sense. Correct! And I'm telling you now, based off all my research, which you can easily verify, this guy is fucking stupid. (laughs) Bonus stage. Yeah, guys, we don't live in a real reality. We live in a construct. Even our nursery rhymes say this. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 merrily. Life is but a dream. Am I right? You're a moron. And you don't deserve anyone's time. You're just a fucking idiot and you need help. Someone literally who plays a character to entertain children, to try to attract children to their streams so that they can beg their parents to contribute.